In this video, we'll cover how to compute the volume of a sphere using volume integral. Let's take the sphere whose radius is r and imagine the center is at coordinate 0, 0, 0 along x, y, z axis. And let's take a point x, y in the surface of the sphere. So, if you look along the x axis and take a small slice, which will be a circle, a small area of the circle will be pi y square. If you look along this direction, a small circle, its radius is y, so the overall area of the small circle is pi r square. Now, if along the x-axis we take a small slice of width dx, the small volume will be the area multiplied by the width, which is pi y square dx. Now, this is a right triangle. And Pythagoras theorem states that square of the long side of the triangle equal to the sum of the square of the shorter two sides. In this case, if we consider this triangle, the R is the long side, so R squared equal the sum of the two short sides which are x square plus y square. In another word, y square equal to r square which is a constant, the radius of the sphere minus x square. So our small volume element becomes pi r square minus x square dx. We want to convert all the element in the small volume in terms of x, r is a constant here. So our volume will be the sum of all the small volume elements along the x-axis. This will be delta volume integral with x goes from minus r to r, which is equal We substitute the small volume here, pi r square minus x square dx. Or we can write this as x equal 0 to r instead of minus r, but multiply this by 2, pi r square minus x square dx. Now we know the integral of dx is nothing but just x. The integral of x square dx is x to the power 2 plus 1 and in the numerator it's 2 plus 1 which is equal x cubed by 3. Using these two equations our volume becomes 2 pi r square multiplied by x minus x cube by 3 where r x goes from 0 to r putting the values 2 pi this becomes r cube minus r cube by 3 minus the term 0 will become 0 so we can ignore that so simplifying this equation we see the sphere volume becomes 3 3 r cube minus r cube is become 2 r cube so 4 pi r cube by 3 so the volume equal 4 pi r cube by 3 Hope you got the concept how to compute the volume of a sphere using volume integral. I'll see you in the next uh, video.